Hey everybody, it is Monday, and if you are in the Nova Scotia, Atlanta, Canada area, it is probably a dreary and nasty Monday out. So I am taking a look once again at the Better Minecraft Mod Pack. Again, this Mod Pack promises to bring features from 1.17, 1.18, and more to the 1.16.5 experience. So far, it's been an interesting exploration. Uh, the Nether was a unique challenge. I could not find a blue biome to get Enderman. I could not uh, find piglins to trade with at a reasonable amount. I was able to track down a 
fortress and get my blaze rods though so i'm picking up where i left off previously and that's raiding this pirate ship full of pillagers which is very likely going to be a challenge in itself so let's get back to her shall we uh, they at me yeah i can hear them uh, angrily grunting i don't have an axe how do i not have an axe <laughs> when you pick when you pick back up on something after a week or more away from it and you just don't know where you are. Okay, okay. I'm gonna have to take a little uh, little trip ashore to grab some things. I do have a boat. And uh, this sword's not in great shape. And I have a spare. Proj Prot, Tinted, Aqua Affinity. I might combine those helmets. I mean, I got the levels. Yeah, I think I'm more or less sort of caught up with what I'm expecting here. settings here in a moment. Getting some uh, inconsistent frame rates here today. <clears throat> that is still a pretty... I don't need clouds. Well, let's see if that's... Uh... See if these help. Ooh, well, that definitely feels smoother. Don't know how I don't have an axe, and I don't have a crafting table, though. So let's uh, let's remedy that. <laughs> Should have seen that one coming. because I've been leaving axes everywhere, come to think of it. Ooh, blackstone, perfect. Actually, I need to make sticks first. And I'm actually not hurting for iron whatsoever at the moment. There we go, that's a bit better. I do have six eyes of Ender, so I'm not in horrible shape. And a single diamond. That's going to be the lifesaver right there. All right, let's uh, let's deal with these jerks, shall we? I mean, they uh, they were grunting pretty angrily at me earlier. I actually think I might drop some TNT on them. in the best shape but they are uh, they're nicely enchanted so I don't exactly want to give up on those boots quite yet all right so I see some chests over here let's see if I can pink salmon raw pork chops so a lot of food a lot of uh, fish I don't exactly recognize oh hey that's an anvil is that my anvil You know what? 25. 25. Oh, yeah, I think I uh, remember making that decision last time. Well, let's just go for it, actually. I know I saw another sword somewhere. Gunpowder. Ah, there's the TNT. This is a very interesting uh, ship in terms of looting. I'll just fix it with some iron bars. I don't want to get Bane of on there. Start. 
start recovering some blocks. I hear them grunting around down there. Oh, watermelon. Oh boy, I'm in trouble here. <sighs> trying to... Trying to build up on the... Uh, I don't know if I lost anything or not. Sitting there trying to build up on that when you can't build on... Uh, you can't build on those. I think I dropped some apples. Let's try this again, but less, uh... Let's... There we go. What you gonna do now, huh? That's right. No point in hitting him with the, uh... The fire. That one's in there. A lot of food. I'll just have some blocks on hand. Wow, actually. Oh, it's a spawner! Ah, I should probably deal with that guy. Yep. <laughs> this is my life now. A lot of food. Interesting. I hear you grunting around in there, buddy. Oh, he probably, uh, maybe fell off. Right. Oh, hey there, Aerodynamic Diode. Welcome to the chat. Uh, welcome back, rather. That's the Wandering Trader. Just popped up in the water here for some... Why is that guy enchanted? Well, anyway, how's your day going today? Uh, getting some of that nasty weather that some of us are getting? Now that I know that that's there. Let's see if I can't find something. Ha <laughs> ha! Perfect. Might be a mistake to hop down there like this, but screw it. What are these? Oh, Crimson Haife. Getting a lot of TNT off of this. I wonder what I can dump for TNT. You know what? Yeah, let's... Let's poke it. I can't really in good conscience walk away from all that TNT. Accidentally hit and ticked off a llama. All right, so uh, not too bad of a selection of treasure on this ship. Oh, there's the enchanted vindicator. Prot one, strong one. Okay. Then, okay, yeah, Nova Scotia is uh, sideways rain today. Like, ex I would say excessive sideways rain. What? Oh, you jerk. You really want to play with this? Ha-ha! <laughs> Take that. Take that. Alright, let's see if I can grab up some more of that TNT then. That is, I think, going to come in handy. Well... Ah, level up Leo, welcome to the chat and thank you for the host. At some point I will have actually committed to memory what each of my notifications are based on sound alone. Right now it took me a moment of to think which one is the fusion one? That's not hosting, right? Alright. Gotta play some inventory management here and I think I'm gonna ditch that. Oh, haven't haven't the heart to ditch pick step. back to haunt me later, but uh, that's how she is. How's your day going today, Leo? And oh, hey, Penel as well. Good to see you both here. That TNT. And I mean, there's a 
lot of good looking stuff here. Private scrap. Proj Prot 3. I've already got Prot 3, which is, I think, more versatile. So that was a cool little find. The Ravager ship. I'm not sure if it makes Minecraft better, but it definitely made things a little more challenging for me there. Dealing with a Ravager spawner. So yeah, exploring fantastic, uh, very interesting mod pack. It's uh, kind of pretty, kind of soothing actually. All kinds of new mobs, new birds, new locations, all kinds of new structures, um, plenty of new biomes. It has definitely brought in some goodies from previous Minecraft version, or future Minecraft versions. On the previous session, it did have that 1.18 style cave going for it. I'm just gonna explore here a little bit before I pick before I grab one of my ender eyes and pick a direction. What is... Oh my! Now that is a beauty! That's probably gonna be full of those jerks, isn't it? Well, I kinda wanna check it out anyway. I'm gonna hit up the uh, ruined portal first. Why is it doing that? Hmm. Weird. For some reason, pressing shift kicked me out of the boat. I've switched uh, shift and crouch from the defaults to uh, that shift is sprint and... Oh, there's a couple ships around here. This is an interesting spot. Oh, yeah. Must be the mod packs doing. All right, all right. I can do something with this. I think there's... Oh, yeah, there is a chest. Ooh, golden apples. Hello, hello. And some taffy. Of course, I'll swap that out there. Let's grab the gold. A lot of gold for Rune Portal. That's got to be a feature of the mod pack itself. Dig away at this obsidian for a moment or two. These will come in handy at some point. Oh wow, it's uh, actually foggy enough that I can't see stuff. Something over there. I know there's a ship in that general direction. I'm going to check out this ship, though. Before I do that, I am dumping the black stone, and I'm going to get some blocks. Just an easy mine, easy break blocks. Raiding that ship and it throws a bunch of dudes at me, I can block them off. As I expect, I'll have a bit of a fight over there. Doing a lot more exploring and a lot less goal oriented. I've been trying to meander my way over to the strong. See if there's any differences in the end in this mod pack. But I keep winding up getting distracted by things that are shiny. Which, oh, that's a flying bird. Well, it's a hover bird at least. And that is, uh, I do, oh, somebody's taking pot shots. Oh, yeah, yeah, that ship is full of dudes. Oh, wow, they are heavily armed. Okay, okay. You guys want to play like that, huh? Let's see 
how you like this. Yeah, clear your throat at me. See what it gets you. See what it gets you. Guess you could say I'm really getting all fired up about this encounter. This, uh, this ship, it's fantastic. I mean, it's lit. Lock of quartz. Ooh, those are expensive boats. <laughs> okay, yeah, just jump off and take pot shots at me. Ah, sucker. That's what you get. That's what you get. And then, when she burns to death, I will, uh, still float around here getting shot at. Let's see if I can spot the spawner once that opens up and take that out. Yeah. Need to get at that spawner, though. Fighting while on a boat is weird in terms of controls. Buddy, where is it? Where is it? There it is! Ha ha! That'll help. Then they all just uh, eventually die. Or I, or I pick them off myself here. Now that I've got their uh, reinforcements sorted. I don't know what's making uh, what's making that noise, but uh, I don't know if I want to meet it. Hello, hello. Crap. And there's something up there with bubbles. Oh, they, those are they shooting tipped arrows at me? I think I gotta go up top. All right, let's uh, let's take this fight to them. Right until they take it back to me and drive me off the ship. That is, because last time these guys kind of whooped me. I know I set it on fire, but this boat is actually less exploded than the last one because I haven't exploded this. Get out of here, pillager. Nobody likes you. Ooh, hello, hello. And this is uh, where they keep all the foods. Nothing per... Bar <laughs> just barrels. Buckets. Early game, finding those buckets would be fantastic. But right now... Yeah, thanks for uh, letting me get free hits on you, buddy. <laughs> it's whack a mole, but the mole whacks you. Is that all of them? Did I win? Ooh, 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 okay. Uh, I don't want the fire prot stuff. I'll take the free iron. And those are better boots. So I don't know what tint it is. Have not found out what tint it is. I'm going to say goodbye to tinted because inventory. But I think I can justify ditching those boots for the Featherfall boots. And... Oh, there's still... Okay, there's still a few of them left. What are you hitting me with here? So, ooh, okay. Ooh, this is a good treasure. Holy cow. What's the, what are these boots? Unbreaking three? I'll take that. I think I get a little bit of work to do here. Don't know what I'm hearing down there. Is that just my footsteps? Slopping around? Yeah, alright. 
gonna turn a bunch of my iron into blocks. Free up some space. <sighs> I don't need a shovel right now. I can always make a shovel later. So I am gonna do that. Make myself a fresh anvil. And then I can get down to a bit of uh, maintenance-y stuff here. Uh, nope, nope. Unbreaking, fire prod. Unbreaking. I already got unbreaking anyway. Good treasures on these, though. Especially that uh, diamond situation. And uh, fire aspect sharpness sword. Yes, please. That is 16. All right. Feather falling and breaking. Let's see if I can put those together. If I can afford it. Yes, I can. Beauty. Getting progressively more stacked as the adventure goes on. I think uh, kind of looks like these ships are worth it. Wow. That cracked off of the first use. Dang. More TNT, and once again, I'll swap my lighter for a fresh one. I'm that guy that everybody hates at the party. Alright. So that was a successful ship raid, and I'm going to go back and check out that other ship, because I'm kind of getting a feel for these guys now. It's definitely not a pride goeth before a fall. I still don't know what a propel pearl is. But, uh, I ate one earlier and it didn't really do much. Might just grab the better food while I'm here. Red mushroom is down. Yeah, I'll grab some pork chops and cook them later. Barrel of barrels. Raw beef. Yeah, that way I can, uh, Get some supplies. So if you know how to take them down, these ships are a good supply source. Oh, good. Hello, zombie. I'm not going to mess with you. Uh, no games to be hit. Look how Nitro is behind me. Yeah, that would be a concern. Thankfully, this is single player. Uh, if, I, if I ever do Manhunt Mondays, I don't expect I'll be having Nitro be the hunter. They're just too good. We have another one of these. Well, this uh, this tech pretty good last time. This is a bigger ship, though. This is a bigger ship. Well, let's uh, <laughs> from a bad day here. Oh, it's got cannons. You see that? It's got dispensers that are meant to be cannons. <laughs> I can hear them being on fire in there. I wish it weren't raining. This would uh, be a bit more of an effective tactic. Yeah. Oh, hey, look at that. Guess what I found. I mean, lots of things. But I think I'm hearing a zombie as well. I'll get that spawner real quick. Beauty. Oh, more diamonds. Okay. Prot 2 helmet. Prot, uh, prot 2 helmet. Ah, proch prot. That's a higher number. Mm. Sleep the rain away. Yeah, if I had a bed, that would be a fantastic tactic. Sleep the night away, sleep the bed away. Uh, sleep the rain away. Whoa. Okay. Yeah. I might have overdid it with the fire this time, actually. This one, uh, the last one didn't go up like this. <laughs> Not 
gonna be enough boat for me to loot. I mean, it is giving those guys a hard time, though. But, uh... I thought I... Whoops! I need that. How is it damaged? I just made this anvil. Come on, come on, come on. And now, 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 that it, now that I've looted it, it's gonna float. Oh, ship sail made of wool. That's a good catch. It probably is, yeah. I just gotta get up there enough to uh, check that out. And deal with this drowned who's on me now. Oh wow, he swims. Like actual swimming animation. Have they always done that? Oh my god. A lot going on here. Got him. Is that, uh... Uh, nope. Let's get back up. I thought that might have been an air pocket. Nothing in the dispenser. Daylight is coming and the rain has stopped. Let's see if I can actually, uh... A lot of them, huh? A little higher. I took out their spawner, so there shouldn't be any reinforcements hap- Ah! Okay. Enjoy your swim. Oh, yeah, there's a few of them popping around here. Okay, he's got, he's got line of sight on me now. And now he's dead. They're shooting some kind of tipped arrows. I know you're up there, buddy. I know you are... Right in the junk. Uh... <laughs> I didn't even hit the one I was aiming at. It was just some... Oh, other guy altogether. I have reduced their numbers to a, by a reasonable amount. Kind of like this. Like, it's an interesting addition to the game. It definitely adds a bit of a challenge. But in a good challenge-reward sort of payout. Like, you're not just... It's not just hard for the sake of hard. Like, if you can take, if you can take over the ship, there's a lot of good stuff you can get off of it. Not just uh, not just the TNT that I've been helping myself to. Those are definitely wool. Yeah, good catch. Uh, beef. Getting them arrows. I think the dragon's gonna be in for a bad time with all this uh, with all this TNT I'm picking up. Uh, I don't think I need the fire res potion anymore. All inventory management sim. Oh, it's just a it's just a purple banner. I thought there might be something special about it. Look at that loot. Ha <laughs> honeycomb. That's a big old fish. Might have overdid it with the fire a little bit. Okay, there's still what? One guy over? Ah, there he is. Oh my god. That's a lot of diamonds. Prod 3 Curse of Van. Ooh, Prod 3 Curse of Prod, Prod 4. Ah, yeah, let's Prod 3. I'll take Pratt 3. Sharpness 2, knockback 1, knockback 1, sharpness 2. This is a bit of a Simpsons ketchup or catsup scenario here. Okay, so right now I'm looking at sharpness 3, so I'd need to put those together for them to even be enough to boost that. 
Oh yeah, you're still here, right? Yeah, could you not? I just realized I'm basically playing this game like Seahawk. I keep setting people's ships on fire. Oh my god, this is broken. Feather Falling 3. I've already got Feather Falling 3, but that is a lot of diamonds. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, if it weren't for these all being enchanted. Well, I got diamonds for uh, when, they, when these pieces of armor break. And I got diamonds to make tools and weapons out of. So, these ships are proving themselves to be very worth hitting. Adventure! Is there anything else up top there? Yeah. This is Minecraft speedrun Seahawk percent. Now I am on fire. <laughs> and I just, uh, did I just, oh no, it's in my inventory. Alright, that's where I came from. <laughs> that's... That's a desert temple, but underwater... Not to be confused with an ocean monument, which is also kind of a temple, but underwater. This is very different. Hmm. 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 Am I going to get jumped by something awful when I go in there? I'll take a little peek. Is there air? Okay. Okay, it's got kind of a similar layout. I'm going to need doors so that I can have air. If only I didn't just destroy a source of wood. Whoops. Oh, wow, that's really going now. Okay, okay. I think this is worth exploring. Fuck, it's shift again. I don't think it's a, a better Minecraft feature that uh, pressing shift gets you out of the boat when it's normally a feature of the crouch button. It's throwing my muscle... M Huh. That is something I'm going to have to check out. I'm finding all kinds of ooh shiny today. Let's get some palm log. I'm going to do a little bit of... Uh, well, for now, I don't need that. Turn that into good. Palm crafting table. Yeah, definitely making me a diamond axe. Palm door. All right. Palm door, and because I got the palm door, I'll ditch the sticks. Don't have don't have anything to cook that pork chop with because I ditched the uh, <laughs> I ditched my stone. I'm really good at thinking ahead. Now where did my boat go? No, I'm, I'm lost a little bit, aren't I? Ah, there's the boat. Nice. And I won't be needing fire underwater. Yeah, that's, uh... <laughs> some... Uh, fire is a little inconsistent in Minecraft. It used to be ridiculous in that if you set a forest on fire, that's basically it. Eventually the whole server's on fire. They nerfed it to the point where fire burns out after a reasonable amount of time. Sometimes you can still get stuff going. Sometimes you can light a thing on fire and kind of count on it to take out maybe three, four blocks. Ooh, I am actually... I've been playing on a, a bit of a one of the preview builds for that. And it is interesting. The, uh, the finished caves are a thing of beauty. Especially those big sprawling ones, the lush caves. Like, there's a lot of really cool stuff that they added to, to that. 
is a hole down there. Oh, that's 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 just cruel. Okay, let's see if I can get out of this. That's the trap. That's the trap. Okay. Dirty, 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 dirty. What? I don't know what just. I don't know what just uh happened here. Everything got green. Returning board. A straddle board. I don't know what that is. Four leaf clover for buzzy or bees. That one's no good. A thunder strike. Oh, wait. I found that one last time. Lava waxed. Stra more board stuff. Now, this, though, another four leaf clover. This is more diamonds and more gold. Both of these are very useful things. Especially since I could do some trading with that gold or I just had a curiosity is there nope thought there might be TNT under there all right let's get myself out of this weird setup there we go finding a lot of interesting stuff in this mod pack I think it was over this way that I saw the big floating thing, wasn't it? Am I wrong? I thought it was over here. Yeah, it is! Nice. And we have this guy just chilling out. Little Grebe. Okay. Ah, oh, there's a duck! Duck, duck. Oh, where's the goose? Alright. What? Have foods? Oh my god! It stole my- it What did it steal? I actually can't tell what it stole. Which is bad, probably. I think that fucker stole my god apple. Oh my god. That seagull stole my god apple. Where are you? Get back here, you son of a bitch. Where's my god apple? Where's my god apple? Oh my god, that is... That is upsetting, actually. <laughs> Freaking seagull stole my god apple. Oh, that sets me on fire. Set me on a fire when I'm underwater. I'm gonna. It wasn't you. Uh, fuck! Did it eat it? How is that an enchanted fish? That is. Oh, there's another seagull. Maybe, maybe you're the one who took my apple. Okay, that is not a better feature, okay? Better Minecraft? That is squarely in the worst when a seagull can just make the most powerful food item in the game disappear out of your hotbar. That is but worse. That is also, oh my god, that is, that is fr here for no reason. What are we going on with that? Beach grass. I'm glad it gave me an advancement for losing my uh, my trump card. Remember earlier what I was saying about, oh, it's adding difficulty without uh, adding too much difficulty. You know, risk plus reward. That, whoever thought of that should be kicked in the nerds. I have to go hunting for desert temples just to see if I can find another god apple. Okay. Okay. 
Those are stronger than the average mob over there. This is a dungeon of some sort. I think it's... He's got mushrooms on his head. That's odd. He's also got diamond boots. I should be tackling this in the daytime. Well, at least I'm getting EXP for uh, combining stuff together. Yeah, could you not? I don't need that. What? Okay. Hello, raccoon. You better not steal my shit. Sharpness 5 diamond pickaxe for some reason. Yo. This, uh, this loot is weird and doesn't entirely make sense. Prot 8 leather pants. Ugh. Uh, I don't know if that's better. Prot. Hmm. Don't know if that's better. Sharpness 5 knockback 1 diamond pickaxe is, uh, weird. Hey, buddy. He's eating rotten flesh. The, uh, the zombie is eating rotten... F the uh, raccoon is eating rotten flesh. Should I be worried? You know, let's see if I can put these guys together. Sharpness 5, knockback 1, unbreaking 3. Oh, it doesn't go that way. Okay, so you can only do it... Th interesting. Ah, oh, I'm torn on what to do with this prot 8 frigging... Leather pants. Prot usually goes up to, what, Prot 4, I think? Prot 5? I think Prot 5, actually. Oh, yeah, I forgot I hit that. Tough choices here. This game is making me make some tough choices. What was the deal on this pickaxe? Jeez. Nope. Don't need you. Alright, let's, uh... Regular skeletons. Oh, looks hey, that's a glowing mushroom. That's pretty. I get a feeling there's a bit of a theme here. Yeah, get wrecked. Huh. Another one of those guys. Don't need the bone. That'll be good for now. Coarse dirt. Oh, it's just coarse dirt. Stay back. I have a sword. <laughs> and a... Uh... Oh. Huh, I didn't even see you there. Yeah, that's right. Get in a fight with each other. Dance, my puppets. Dance. They're still duking it out there, huh? <laughs> okay. Oh. Got you. opportunity to cook some of that. Whoa! Personal space, buddy. Personal space. Same to you. Alright. I'll hang on to that in case uh, whatever pants I happen to be wearing at the time break on me. 
pork chops at the campfire. Spend a little bit of that night time. Yeah, there we go. What is that? Well, I got my boat. Looks like there's a little house over there. If only I had, if only Optifine worked with this. Mushroom skeleton. Yeah, mushroom creatures are interesting. Give me that pork chop. Baby zombie. Go away, baby zomba. Zombie. There we go. Nice. So I'm just gonna climb this thing. I'm sure nothing will show up to throw me off of here. Oh, hello! <laughs> this guy can eat some damage. It's almost like he's covered in diamond armor. Place. Whoever lives here has put a lot of thought into guard guarding it. There we go. Huh. Red mushroom. Baked potato, iron ore. Don't really need the iron ore. I'll take the potatoes for now until something pops up that is worth ditching them for. This is kind of a cool thing, though. Like, this whole... Huh. A little bit of everything here. Like, I do wish that there was more of this in the stock game uh, world generation. God, what is this? That is a nightmare over there. Right, what's the chest piece? What is the... <sighs> Prot 3, but it's pretty much broken. It's not necessary. Oh, jeez. Okay. More baked potats. Are we looking at six or twelve? Oh, I'm not paying twelve when I could pay six. There we go. Prot four. Nice. This is this is actually really cool though. Is that a jukebox with a song in it? Huh. Ward. Oh 
yeah, it's this side. I can finally see what see what other side is. Hmm. Also, did not see that or that. There's a lot to explore here. Good. Double check jukebox. I'll toss that down to 30 because the song is nice, but she's a little on the loud side. How is that? How is that even louder? Music and sound, jukebox, music. It's not my imagination, though. It is louder after me turning it down, right? keeping that song i can always make a jukebox later so i'm not taking that with me the other song is a stock minecraft song so i'm not as invested in that one but i'm keeping this one caves and cliffs backport interesting must be new content then wow ah! holy crap wow <laughs> oh god gonna have to take these guys out though oh, I'm going up in here there we go a little bit of a choke point that's you that's you there's definitely a witch. I'm hearing a witch cackling down over there. Oh, yeah. I was going to get rid of those because these skeletons are a better source of arrows. There we go. If I were to pour a... Oh, wow. That is a witch witch. <laughs> yeah. Potion your way out of that one. Now, now the barrier that's protecting me is on fire. Smart. So are all the horrors that were. Uh... Oh no! Now, it, now I am on fire. Went out before I get my bucket out. You'd think I'd have learned some sort of lesson about playing with fire, but, uh, nah. Yeah! Get wrecked. What is this? Sharp? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm playing around with. Ah! Back in the fire. And that's, I think, just a regular leather helmet. Leather cap, yeah. Well, I'm gonna do, whoa! I'm gonna do a little firefighting. Much like a lot of generations of Pokemon games. Okay, okay. I'm uh, liking one. Prot three diamond boots. Oh, Featherfall, though. Mm. That's actually annoying. 
Once again, I am playing... What do I ditch? Well, you know what? I'm just not going to... Prot 2... Prot 2 diamond chest, but it's severely damaged. Ah. Screw it. So if I just spent basically an entire day fighting my way through this... Oh! Oh! Sneaky! These guys are smart. Let's go up this way. Unless that was the only way. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, yeah, those are just barrels. Uh... I hear you out there, baby zombie. <laughs> Drop something good for me, would you? No? Uh... Hey. <laughs> Hello? Pipes. <laughs> All right. Oh, this game really wants to give me iron and baked potatoes. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll take the free baked potatoes. If only the game could throw me a little sour cream. Oh wait, I don't need Mr. Sharpness there. the bones putting a lot into uh, trying to conquer this uh, ooh prot 3 feather falling 4 that's a bomb not to be confused with dub bomb so prot 3 curse of vanishing prot 3 Whoop, did not mean to throw that away Prot four curse of vanishing, so that's twelve repair. That is six. Nice. Prot four iron helmet. What else we got here? Feather falling four boots versus feather falling three. I'll take them. Eh, viciously vein mining. Mining. Interesting. Now I am gonna want to play with these. Maybe I'll regret that. But uh, there, that's the bomb. I already made that joke. Hmm. Uh, I will hang on to you for now then. Actually, I'll be right back. I'm just gonna make a bunch of golden apples here. And then I'll just uh, ditch the rest of my apples. It seems like it's actually cold here. That way I can carry those boots around until I can uh, actually afford to put them together. Glowberries. Don't need red mushroom name tag. I don't need any of the rest of that. There are a lot of angry fellows up. What does this do? Okay. You right click it, you throw it, it explodes. Pretty straightforward. I like that. Now, who lives here? Is it just zombies that live here? A lot of iron ore for some reason. Spider. I'm hearing a lot of footsteps down there as well. Right now, I don't know what my exit strategy is. Because I gotta go back through a lot. More baked potatoes. A lot of interesting stuff that you just throw at me. Don't need that iron ore. I am... I am tripping on iron. Oh, hello! That explains some things. Haha, <laughs> get bombed. Her armor 
is eating this. Like, right now I'm getting the benefit of the whole Three Stooges situation. They got good armor. Wish they drop more of it. Okay, what's this pickaxe? Sharpness 5, knock back. Okay, I've already got that uh, accounted for in a pickaxe. Just toss that into the pile along with the spider eye that I also don't need. Enjoy being on fire. I know I don't. Still sounding real zombie up top there. This is this is proving to be an interesting challenge. All right, I don't think. That. All right, let's see. There, there can't be that many more. Whoa! Better not turn out to be a spawner up there. I'm just gonna burn this whole place down. That's right, that's what you get. A lot of these guys up here. Just let me get my free damage on ya. Man, I wish I hadn't enchanted. Okay. <laughs> Sucker. What are those? Feather fall? Oh, no, wait. Those are the boots I already had. Right. Right, right. It's getting quieter up there. to fight hard to gain this bit of ground. That better be worth it. Prot 2 cha chain mail. Oh, we got pumpkins. We got hay bales. I know, real exciting stuff that was definitely worth uh, an entire day of fighting my way up here. Whoa! Oh, it's the mushroom guy. No? Okay. Just jumped down on me. I am taking your hay bales, though. Oh, okay. Oh, an enchanted bomb? I don't know what to think of that. I'm taking it. We're going to see what it's going to do. Slime balls, bread... Uh, prop two, no. Oh yeah, I can now float these bones. Oh! Hello! That's a new music disc. You know what, I don't think I'm gonna wind up using this. So I'll take that. Blue bomb, huh? I'll put that there. There's a lot of cool stuff I want to check out here, and I'm pretty much wrecked this nice sword fighting my way up top. Alright then. Enjoy being on fire. <laughs> Did he... Kiting me? Is that skeleton actually kiting me? Who taught these? Who taught these guys? You don't even have any brain in there. Whoop. 
Neither do I, because I just popped up and got myself shot for free. Yeah, that's right. Come on down. Come on down. Come on down. I'll take the EXP. Could I afford that? Nah, I don't think I can afford that yet. Plus, feather falling is not on my concern. Ha! Wow, he he just ran. So when do they run? I also just noticed this. There's, this place is packed full of... Oh, wow, this place is just packed full of treasures. I will say, they do take the time to reward you if you put the work in to uh, dig around. Right, I think there's just one left. Yeah. What is this all about? Ooh, big chest, big chest, big chest. Aqua Affinity. Aerial of what? Oh, hello. What is Aerial of? Oh my god. Let me, let me, t let me assess things with you. What is Aerial Affinity? Is that, is that for under the sea? Golden apple. Aqua affinity, so some diamondy goods. Prot for uh, no, that's no that's not useful to me. That is definitely <laughs> wonder if there's any Yeah, there are crafting tables, okay. Let me just uh yeah, let me just do that. So I can grab even more iron. Well there's another bomb. What the heck is Aerial Affinity? Huh. Well, I gotta make some inventory space here because I do want to see what Aerial Affinity is all about. Yeah, my pants are not in the best of shape right now. Aerial affinity. Well, I don't even have the levels right now. I'll hang on to the aerial affinity one for when I have the levels. Just, I have no idea what that is. I assume I'm flying and it makes me mine faster. Fo just following, you know, the aqua affinity. But, uh, huh. Well, let's see what other goodies are up here. I'll use this bomb for now and hang on to the blue bomb. Maybe I'll uh, blue bomb the uh, dr the dragon. Huh. Chipped anvil. Oh, chipped anvil versus damaged anvil. Well, you're coming with me. Oh, oh! Bombs, coal, uh, more iron. The, uh, the loot in this is pretty good, I will say. I mean, it definitely throws some difficult situations at you, but it pays you well for them. All right, let's, oop, let's actually climb the ladder instead of being bad at ladder. Oh, cool, one more of these. So is the mushroom on his head protecting him from being caught on fire by the sun? Oh cool, another one of you. I have a lot of questions about these uh, mushroom skeletons. Huh. Is this just a... Uh, is that just a... Huh. Hmm. Well, I'm going to see if there's anything up there, and then I'm going to go down there. I don't think there's anything. I think it might just be a decorative mushroom by the looks of it, but... I would kick myself if I didn't check it out. Just in case, like, there's something in it.
yellow terracotta for some reason. So it's a part mushroom, part rock. Does not appear to have anything uh, special about it, though. Did not get the timing on that. Just gonna take the lazy way down for this one. Ha ah, ha ha! They can't reach me. That's an Enderman. Uh, more bizarrely enchanted goods. I do want to get my hands on that guy, though. Mr. Enderman over there. Is he already... He's already zipped off somewhere. I was gonna look at him and get him to come over. Alright, now where... Which direction were those other buildings? Ugh. This, this doesn't sound good when I'm walking around on it. Oh, there he is. Hello, Mr. Enderman. Yeah, let's, uh, let's party, buddy. Oh, yeah. He's gonna teleport like mad trying to get to me. Right. Right. Hey, buddy. But if I go down there, then the zombies... <laughs> the... Actually, that takes care of some of that. still hear whatever's going on up there. Oh, it's a tripwire. Interesting. Well, if the... Uh, if the Enderman decides to come looking for me, I'll take him on. You know what, let's see what this is. Sky music. Flying Starlight. That's where I'm going next. I bet that'll be an interesting journey. over here frog actually frogs huh. right, there's a few things I want to check out over here of course the big building the tower and that little shack I think that might just be a witch's hut but it's not usual biome you'd expect a witch's hut so I think that that warrants some investigation this one definitely has more of those uh, enchanted guys that I'm gonna have to fight my way through that last one was a treasure trove though so I gotta, I gotta take a look at it oh yeah ghost ghost friggin right oh Okay. Right, those, uh... Huh. Okay. It's this kind of, uh... Ooh, ooh. Weaponsmith eye patch. Can I, uh... Can I wear that? I, mean, I don't want to... I don't want to replace my enchanted helmet with a very basic... Eye patch, so. 
go upstairs. This is the one that had all those invisible skeletons in it. Because uh, this game can't be mean enough, it has to throw invisible skeletons at you. But, okay. It also gives you a lot more gold and diamonds than the average. Rope arrow. Huh. Rope arrow. Kind of want to see what this is about. Ah! It makes a rope! What? It just makes rope. Okay. Well, I guess I kind of wasted it then, but... Uh... Stop having so much health, huh? This guy, another patch, uh, plain iron leggings. Not as much of value this time around. Is this the top? Kind of seems like that might be the top, yeah. That's what you get. Look at the, look at that. They're, they've already respawned down there. So this area just spawns invisible skeletons. Alright, let's get out of this nightmare factory. Ah, not too bad, I think I've gotten the bulk of what I want out of here though. Alright, I might as well pop by the witch hut. See if that is in fact a witch hut. I am betting that it is though. Oh, this is like some kind of special witch. I mean, this is kind of a swampy area. Oh yeah, that's just straight up a witch hut. Yeah. Yeah, that's what you get. I think there's... Oh, hey, a witch's hat. <laughs> Alright. Any cosmetics? Nope. I, I guess this is kind of a swamp, eh? And then there's this tower. And this tower is looking interesting. I think I came across one of those on the last session, but... I can't remember a lot about it, so I think it'll be worth checking out. Probably gonna be full of uh, invisible skeletons taking pot shots at me. Nothing in there. Ah! Okay. Surprise! Just a skeleton. Ah, okay. I was like, what? Oh, spawner. This is just a skeleton tower. Aqua affinity. Cat, cat. Okay. 
not the uh, level of treasure I've become accustomed to. This one's gonna have a zombie spawner in it. And an enchanted zombie, apparently. Uh, roof bits are making it hard for me to maneuver. Alright, I gotta get up here and... Yeah, deal with that. Huh. That's ah. Alright. Oh, yeah. Ha ha, funny tower, lol. I didn't put that there. Somebody did. Just golden gear. And, uh, Lena Rain, other side. Other side, that's already the one that I've got. I don't expect that the Minecraft devs will be adding haha -ha funny tower to the game anytime soon so that one that one doesn't come to us from uh... oh a vex what are you doing here i mean aside from trying to kill me there better not be a vex spawner up there uh, another other side hey none of that That is a Vex spawner, holy crap. Hey, no, no. Get stabbed. Oh my god. Do not like these guys. They, uh... Of damage. They are hard to pin down. Silk touch. Don't really need silk touch. I'm pretty sure the the last of them just flew off somewhere. Stall. Buried dungeon map. So what is up here? Anything of gold blocks? Hey, there you are. Oh, it's just swarming with vex. Tear of Vex. Okay. We'll cry about it. Alright, fine, fine. Gosh darn it. There we go. Got a hit on him. They're very vexing. Got a couple hits on you, though. Oh, my goodness. He's dead. If I'm fighting Vex, I expect to be getting a totem of undying out of the whole ordeal. So this is just rude. I am taking your gold blocks, though. You can live here trapped forever. Lots of golden armor for some reason. And, uh... Alright! So... Let's see... <laughs> yeah! Now, that is a big old mushroom place. Are those... Ah, crap! It's, no it's phantoms! Crap, crap, crap! Crap, crap, crap. Uh, definitely should have slept at some point. Oh. This could be a village, though. And a really cool mushroom house. I'm 
Gonna go to this village house, though, because there's gotta be a bed in here. I can sleep phantoms away. Ooh. I wonder who lives here. Oh, he lives here. Where's your bed, buddy? Yes. Yes! Beauty. Yeah, nice house here for me to definitely not burgle. up here. Ooh, sorry, I'm definitely taking that end veil. What is end veil? What is bounce? I might look into I might look and see what bounce is all about actually. Now did he have a crafting table floating around here somewhere? Let's make a little space. Oh, I ditched my apples. Oh, wow, that was a good call. I do, however, want to see what bounce is all about. Doesn't go on the boats. Um, prop one, fire prop four, I'm breaking three. Uh, I'll have to gather some apples along the way, I think. Let's see if I can afford to put these guys together yet. Unbreaking aerial, unbreaking feather fall, fire prot. I don't want the fire prot though. So let's uh, put regular prod on it. 13. Is that 4? Perfect. 14. 16. All right. Well, I'm still taking that with me because I got to see what aerial affinity is all about. I'm also putting a lot of effort and resources and all that into iron gear when I have a solid chunk of diamonds. All right, so we need meat to actually put that there like that. Put some bombs in my hotbar. really struggling with uh, what to take with me and what to leave behind in here because I am doing pretty good treasure wise still don't know how to actually use these dragon eggs that I've been finding all right let's uh let's loot the rest of this guy's place huh, that's cool Ah, that is cool. Oh, a perfect anvil. Okay. Trade, yeah. <laughs> Nothing in that. Smithing table. Smithing table would be great if I had netherite. Oh. You're really, really making me make some hard choices here. It's on the helmet. Aqua Affinity. All right. 
Unbreaking, Blast Prod, Sharpness 2, Fire Aspect, Sharpness 3, Fire Aspect 2, so that would do nothing other than fix it. I like that they pre-fuel those. Okay. Cute little hut. I don't need horse armor. Why do I have... Why did I have horse armor? It's like what we told Bethesda when they did the whole thing with Oblivion years ago. We don't want horse armor. Let's see what this is all about. Oh! 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 Okay. It's like a goo skeleton. Are you doing slowness? Are those slowness arrows? What a jerk. My pants are gonna break. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. What? The carp? Oh. The slow, the, uh, the field of view thing, it trips me up a little. Oh my god, no. Slowness. Those guys were jerks. And a witch, and a creeper. All right. I hear you up there. What's in the box? More, more iron. Like, this is throwing, I would say, an excessive amount of iron at me. I'll take it until I run out of inventory space. Probably shouldn't have broke that. Hmm. Weird. From the outside, it, uh, looks like it would have a bigger interior, but it doesn't seem like there's much room in here at all. So there's that place that I set fire to. There's a very pink forest. There's some houses over this way. And it looks like that might be a little bit of a town. I think the town is worth checking out. This is, is this just all terracotta? Can't even burn that down. Pretty sure this is the one I just ransacked. So I'll go onward. I got loot for days. Another perfect anvil. I didn't even see that on my way in. I need levels. And as we load a new area, the frame rate takes a bit of a hit. Ooh, okay. That looks cool. Actually, that looks like that might be a fight. Alright. Let's do a little prep if it's going to be a fight. Hello, yellow tulip. What are you doing taking up my inventory space? So I'm still sitting on boots that I want to improve. I can afford it now. Alright, we will see... Presumably what aerial affinity is all about. Also, what this is all about. Zombies, just a bouldering zombie coming out. Get wrecked. Oh, 
Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's, uh, that's what I thought I'd hear. I may not be in here very long. Is it just the one guy? Oh, nope, 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 nope. Oh, they are coming home. All right. Fighting it out with those guys is rarely worth it. Actually, it was pretty worth it on those ships. That's a crow. As long as it's not a seagull stealing my golden apples. I'm still ticked about that. Okay. Well, if they're not constantly spawning, this falls back into, I'm going to explore this territory. Oh, no. Thought I could uh, shimmy my way up that. Doused torch. Okay. Yeah. Big jar top. What's in the... Nothing in that chest. Smite two. Barrel, 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 barrel. Looks like it's just like a little outpost. Huh. Yeah, I hear you out there, buddy. I like the style of it. Let's see what's over here before I go up top. Rabbit stew. Yeah, you can stack rabbit stew in this, which is a nice improvement. You know what? Yeah. Wait, this is a meal. Oh, yeah, five shanks. I'll take the rabbit stew. already here. <laughs> Did I? Oh! oh! That could have gone badly. What's up in here? More empty barrels. Spider. I was kind of hoping I could uh, stab the spider through the thing, but it's not looking like it. Oh, yeah, there's a ladder right here that I somehow managed to ignore. This is probably not worth anything, actually. Thorns one. What do I got? I don't have thorns. Hmm. Thorns is kind of worth it. Eleven or eleven. Guess this is. Oh, wait, really? Go, go, get, get, get. <laughs> I beat him to death with the chess piece. I guess I'll hang on to this one until I have enough exp to use it. Pretty sure I've been over there. I think I was going to head over that way. Huh. Interesting. <laughs> Did I... I don't know if I did hit that building up or not. I'm going to take a quick peek, see if it jogs my memory. Oh, yeah, rabbit stew makes me jumpy. I don't think I've been here. Oh, yeah. oh, I'll check it out now. I feel like this is uh, very similar to the other outpost. Probably just more of the same by the looks of it. I 
There's something over that way. Not sure if it's just a weird tree. But I am going to go check that out. Miss my bucket somehow. Ha! Huh. Yeah, I don't care. I'm going to check out that hut. And then I'm going to go in that forest and see if I can find that weird tree or whatever it actually was. Ooh. That's a pretty house. Who lives here? I don't know who lives here, but I'm sleeping in your bed. And I'm just gonna... Ooh. Fisherman. Okay. Ah, there we go. Let's see what's up top. It's just, uh... You know, everybody has a hay attic. Okay. And some leggings. I do need to, to pack up my leggings. They are in bad shape. I was hoping to slap some more enchantment on them. But uh, I'll take being fixed. Apples. Beauty. I did need apples. I was going to put something else in there. <laughs> Weird. Yeah, all I got to do is either make or find a crafting bench. Oh, right. Yeah, I should probably uh, start by making some bars. And then make some gaps. Nice. Yeah, that'll that'll keep me alive. Let's swim along here then. I'm pretty sure that thing that I saw was over in this general direction. Unless I'm all turned around, of course. Which, not ruling that out. Oh, no, I think it was just that tree. I think it was that uh, purpley tree there. Mangrove roots. Yeah, I think that is what I was seeing from uh, over there. Kind of bummed that it turned out to be a tree, even if it is a pretty tree. Twig neck. Duck eggs. I want to eat some duck eggs where to go. Let's just head sort of this way. What, what was that? Prop gear. I don't know what that is. And I'm not sure I like popping around in this marsh. stuff in this though what's over there different kind of forest I think Tall trees. Cypress! They definitely have added a lot of tree types to this. Oh, oh, water silk. Okay, don't like it. Don't like it. Hello, goblin. Yeah, okay. Hey, what, what do you got for me, buddy? Uh, apples for... Ah, uh, yeah, he can enchant beyond limits. 
Doesn't really have anything. I can he can also repair an anvil slightly. Doesn't really have anything that I want though. Let's see if I can actually jump properly. Now I'm in kind of area. Bit of muffs a couple baby zombies go away. something a little less covered. All right. I have indeed found some beauty here. Also a, another one of those houses. Can check that out of course. Just because then I can eat them out of my inventory. I really should look into making a backpack. I know this mod has them. Which, I do wish they would add something like that to Minecraft. I know they gave us shulker boxes. But a lot of my backpacks, you can open them right out of your inventory. Whereas with shulker boxes, you get to put them on the ground. And they're a game as well. Like, you have to have eaten off to the end islands without fighting the dragon or you have to have beaten the dragon so you know not the most efficient all right give me a moment all right let me uh take a look i do like as long as it means i don't have to manage heat and the like, I do like that I can see my breath. That's so kind of a nice realism sort of touch. What's up here? That... That is... It looks like a portal. Is this an Aether mod? Is this an... Okay. So regular fire doesn't... Do it. Hmm. That, that, that definitely looks like a portal, though, eh? Blue skies. I actually think I'm going to look this one up. I haven't been looking really anything up. All right, have a good one, Leo. Just uh, just saw your message there. Enjoy eating food. That's always important. All right, so blue skies, Minecraft, poise, stone, bricks, portal. Let's see if that's a thing. Blue skies. Uh, well, I'm not finding anything immediately. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on that right now. Sure looks like that could be a portal. Probably just has a different ignition method, if I had to guess. Whoa! Hello, gatekeeper. Huh? Oh, I get it now. Zeal lighter. Yeah. Oh, it makes, makes fire. Here, I, here I've been finding these guys all over the place and being like, Zeal Lighter, what is that? I don't need that. But I bet... Yes! So. What is this gonna be, I wonder? <laughs> Jump. Forever bright. Forever bright. Trade journal gatekeeper. What is this? So it's not it's not an aether mod, it's something else. That is a big honking wall. Holy cow. She's uh Oh! 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 
something, uh, something was hurting me. Is it this? Looks like I'm not able to progress. Okay, okay, okay. Enter a nature dungeon, forever bright. That is that is off limits. I get it. I get it. All right. I was just trying to see. I'll look around a little bit. I think I will make note of my chords though, because I am gonna hate myself if I can't get back. Let's see what that outpost over there is all about. That's a ghost bear, and it is not friendly. Or are you friendly? Oh no. Polar Geist! <laughs> That's a Polar Geist! That's. Okay! I'm frozen. I'm frozen. Oh, there we go. Polar Geist. Uh, thank you, whoever wrote this. Seems this weapon doesn't work as well here. Awesome! Yeah, I bet I have to get a whole different kind of... I don't know, seems to be working fine enough to me. If I gotta get a whole different set of weapons, I am not doing that right away. Hey, buddy! I'm gonna let you out. Yeah, it doesn't work at... <laughs> wow! I feel like that's a little rude, game. Do this to me like that. I am not getting a whole separate set of gear to explore this, though. I will say that much. Uh, I'm gonna let some of these golems out. That's pretty nuts. Oh! Oh, somebody mad. Oh, hello. A diophyte prowler. You want to be rude? I think the terrain is the only thing saving me from getting wrecked by this guy. What is... What did he drop? A raw municipal monkfish. Okay. I didn't vote for it. I'm going to let these guys out. Buddy, nobody deserves to be in a cage like that. Probably don't really need to. Uh... There you go. You're free. You're free. Free to distract my enemies while I explore this. It's like a pillager tower. I'm not really hearing pillagers though. And normally they'd be all over the place. Let's see what we got in here. Cookies! That's what we got in here. Diorite? It's a lot of diorite in this. More cookies! I'll take the free arrows. Rabbit. Well, it's not very impressive. And, uh, that looks like that goes on for quite some ways in every direction. So I think I'm going to put a pin in exploring this place for now and get back to the overworld. Especially since I don't seem to be equipped to uh, deal with a lot of the stuff here. I expect I will have to get a whole separate set of gear, probably making some stuff out of the local materials, which will be interesting in looking into eventually a brewberry. But for now, I'm gonna go back through. Now that I, oh no, another, po another polar geist. Come on, buddy. Not, oh shh, okay. Slippery. Oh. Is 
seems uh, effective enough to me. What did he drop? Soul Fragment. Okay. <laughs> um, uh, huh. Looks like there's a uh, mineable bits. Oh, yeah, it doesn't like me. It doesn't like me being there. It doesn't like me being there. Thought I could get close enough. Well, the zeal lighter is interesting in itself. I'm just gonna go back through. I wonder if I could make one of these portals. Nope. If I can make one of these portals uh, out of these blocks myself. Now, where is your bed? I'm going to pick a direction here. I'm going to go. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, good. They didn't break. Oh, that would have been wasteful. Especially since I'm already hurting for ender pearls. I'm going to start heading towards the stronghold. Take some attack of opportunity exploration on cool stuff along the way, of course. Hopefully not get completely turned around and derailed. Ah, who am I kidding? I'm definitely getting turned around and derailed. Wow, everything angry here. Okay. Well, I found... Wow! Is that multiple skeletons, or am I getting... Yeah, it's multiple skeletons. Okay, I was gonna be like, is there some sort of rapid-fire skeleton taking pot shots at me now? Hello? I like that double doors actually open. Like, instead of you having to open each door individually, they function as a double door. That is a nice mod-specific addition that I'm pretty okay with. I don't think I meant to go up here. Ah. So this is uh, somebody's home that's still just under construction. I wonder if the intent is that a player could move in. Well, those are the two skeletons, so I am working on the assumption that I'm going in this way. I don't know what that is. All right. I do like how even though they're roaming with undead, there's a certain serene beauty to the forest. <laughs> Hey, we cool, we cool, right? Yeah, we cool. What is this? It's enormous. It is a big boy. That is probably a serious business dungeon. Wait. If it sets other things on fire. Oh, it does! Okay, so it works like a regular lighter. Cool, then I am ditching that to save some inventory space. I have a feeling I am going to be in need of some help if I try to take this thing on. They're not coughing up seeds. Interesting. So, 
That ought to be plenty. Combined with the iron blocks that I've got. What? It, it, this is like a whole biome. What is this? Aww. Holy cow. Is, is there a way in or do I just tower my way up? Holy cow. Whatever this is, it's kind of incredible looking. Uh, I definitely want to explore. I'm not. I'm not leaving without checking this out. Everywhere. Hey, I see an in. It is. <laughs> Don't need that. Getting surprisingly good mileage out of these. Uh... Guns and Roses. Visit the Thornborn Towers. The Thorn... Yeah, Thornborn. Okay. Isn't, isn't that that guy from Overwatch? Yeah, I'm hearing skeletons. Whoa! All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> what? Do they have, do they have potions? Those skeletons had potions. Huh. I know what I am doing. I'm getting my bombs out. I'll piss off, witch. Ha <laughs> ha, sucker. <sighs> I was kind of hoping it was a healing potion that he was going to give me there. I have a feeling this experience is going to be mean, just based on that uh, welcoming committee there. Oh my god, oh my god. Alright. So a big part of this is going to be neutralizing those spawners right away. some of their armor so I could see what it's all about. Right, I'm going to have this on standby because I'm probably going to have to mine another... Sp oh, treasure. Ooh, okay. Good amount of treasure there. I'm going to eat... That's a lot of bread. I mean, I have a lot of travel bread, so really, I don't need to be spending the inventory space on this. All right, let's switch that out for that. Uh, hmm. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see how she goes. If I get chased down, I can place it real quick. Oh, bees. Bees, okay. Is there a spawner? Is there a spawner? No. No, all right. Hey, buddy. Yeah! 
get him. Oh, he still threw the friggin' potion at me. Go on up there, buddy. Oh, you're, you're having a little trouble fitting? Hey, don't hit, don't, don't accidentally hit. He just got dropped. A lot of help you were. A lot of these guys, holy cow, where are they all coming from? Yeah, come on down there. Yeah, here we go. Get wrecked. Thank you, Mr. Skeletal. dude wander off to oh there he is yeah he's not he's not getting back up there I wish those were healing potions so that way I could at least benefit from it oh, and the thing is I don't even know where the um oh sneaky Thanks for the EXP. Last I checked, I can't eat bones. But I can eat steaks. Alright. See if I can afford to thorns it up a bit yet. 11 or 11. Beauty. That way I can actually pay these guys back a little when they when they're wailing on me. Oh my helmet's in bad shape actually. If only I had some sort of bars of iron. Spruce planks, eh? Let me just grab one more spruce plank. Make a spruce workbench. Crafting table, rather. Because this game just is really intent on giving me an absurd amount of iron. So I might as well block that all up. I can use it to build a flex house later. Oh, I'll definitely take those golden carrots, though. This is a pretty cool building. I do know when I finally get out of here, I am going to have no idea whatsoever which direction I came from. I'll have to toss another eye at that point. Ah! Whoa! Oh my god. Spawner. Combo me. You're not supposed to use those tactics. Holy. Oh, but the mobs, uh, the mobs seem a little smarter in this. Oh, an idea. 
wanted to block that. Fine, I'll kill you first. I wanted to make it so that, uh... Oh my god. Give me a minute to think, would ya? There we go. Whew. <laughs> These guys are definitely making me work for it. There we go. That way, he can't fall down it. Huh. Honey bottle. Crossbow. Lots of honey bottles. Hmm. Do I want the honey bottles? And it is kind of a lo The blood moon rises? What? What? Uh... Does this mean all the guys I killed respawn? Or is that just a Legend of Zelda thing? Let me grab some of this, because I need some building blocks. There's a blood moon on the rise. Well, I sure don't need bones. I'll keep some honey on hand as a light snack. Keep my saturation up. Alright. So there's the way through in there. I don't. No, I don't think it is. I think. I'm gonna have to make my own way up. <laughs> hey, fellas! Meet my friend! Oh wow, they are, they are, uh, determined. Cover me, cover me. Holy cr They are, they are very determined to get me specifically. They don't even care about my golem. Oh, there's a ladder right there. This is more of a challenge than anything in vanilla Minecraft other than uh, fighting the wither. I mean, the end boss is definitely easier than this place. Easier than a lot of the stuff I've come across. Yeah, I'm gonna run off of stakes for now. When I run out of stakes, that's when I look for, sa for uh, scavenged calories. I think that's a good play. I'm tying up a lot of inventory space here. Oh. And then something comes behind me and pushes me off. I hear a zombie. This is kind of incredible. Oh, hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. There's a couple of you. Feel free to pop on up and uh, pay me a visit. Look, I know you guys can teleport. I know you guys can teleport. Are you seriously not gonna, though? Do I gotta hop down and... Guess I'm gonna uh, hop down.
Be afraid to, uh, you know, cough up the eyes. I guess more pop them out of your eye socket than cough them up. Where's he gone? Where's he gone? Oh, you are being obnoxious, buddy. Where's he gonna come at me from? Ah, honey only stacks to 16. Long term, that is not a good food source. Good to know. Don't know where the other guy has wandered off to. Interesting usage of stairs. Where did he come from? expect him to come through that. How did you do that? Oh, right. Right there. Space. Yeah. Where did... Oh, my God. That's where they're coming from. Alright. I don't want to hurt the kiwi. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Wow, they have done that much damage to him already. Job of uh, making friends. Oh, yeah, get him, get him, Timmy. The other way. Oh, you jerk! Yo. Turn on the air conditioner and chill. Ooh, stairs. Ooh, bed. Bed, bed. You may not rest now because the current lunar event forbids it, but it means I can respawn, and that is going to be pretty important. <laughs> I might die here. Uh... 
Oh, yeah, I don't need stairs. The blood moon sets, the undead begin to burn. Oh, it probably just makes the undead immune to daylight. That's cool. Uh, what do we got up here? Another bed. Oh, yeah. So, those are phantoms that also shoot at you? You know what? I just realized it's almost 4.30. I have been going for 2 hours, 22 minutes at this point. I'm going to take a little bit of a stretch, get a snack. I'm going to take a... Uh, I'll come back at 4.35. I'll drop that in the chat so that I can remind myself as well. 4.35 is when I will be back taking a break. I need to stretch. I need to eat. I need to drink. I need to punch that guy down the stairs. All right. Options. Throw the music down. And I'll throw up my screen here for my uh, hydrate break. And peg step jazz, which is in this folder. Enjoy.
right, I am back from getting a snack. And let me put, make sure I got the right screen up on here. Pop back into the game. That was a fantastic uh, remix of Pig Step by Insane in the Rain Music featuring Lena Rain, who made the original Pig Step. So again, I think that's pretty cool when a, a composer of something gets involved in the remix scene. So I am ready to pop back into exploring this cursed place. So let's see what all we got going on in here. Ah, uh, right. Oh, they'll burn to death. Those are enormous. Those. So those are like super phantoms. Beetroot, just just beetroot. For some reason. Are they gone? They are super phantoms. Ooh! I didn't notice that. Ooh, nice, 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 nice. This game has been uh, decently generous with some interesting treasures. I think I've been through there. That looks like it's worth checking out, though. Uh huh. Where are you? You're a phantom, my ass. Oh, they have fire res. Good lord. I can get some reinforcements up there. Why? I don't know if I can. Damn it. Improvise. Overcome. Come on. Come on. Come on. Clearly, I can do something with these stairs here. Oh! What? Don't know. Don't know how that's happening. Oh, no. What is throwing arrows at me? Let's uh... Got you. Fireproof phantom. Fireproof giant phantoms. And it's just swarming. They, they must have a spawner. Tougher than the other skeletons to do. Alright, I need to create enough space so that this guy can spawn properly. So I can get some reinforcements out there. What is hap- Oh yeah, they are definitely, uh... Yeah, there's a guy up there. Really happened to fight for this. Was not expecting this much of a fight when I came up here, but uh... oh, hello, spawner. Let's see if I can get myself in. God, would you piss off? Might wind up regretting that when he can't go up the stairs because I broke him. Behold! And what did I say about not being able to go up the stairs? It's okay, I just go up here until I can get. Oh, come on. Till I can get... I can put the stairs back. Polished andesite, that's pretty. Oh, 
get on up there and mess him up. Are you serious, man? Hey. I need you to move so that I can give you better stairs. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna die. Get on up there, come on. Oh, one of them already died. <laughs> Yes! Come on. So many of them. Is that the only spawner? Oh! Oh, that is some serious knockback they're packing. Danger. Holy crap. Okay. Water bucket. <gasps> oh boy. Oh wow. Oh, am I getting back into the fray there? Should be able to. Hey, buddy. There's a lot going on up there. Like, uh, I don't know if this is soloable. At least I've got my respawn. Ah, yes, here we go. Well, I took care of the spawner. I'm not hurting for arrows. Oh, they're riding them! And they have crazy knockback, like... Uh... Let's see if I can... <laughs> that butterfly just got in the way. I think, uh, I think taking out that spawner has definitely helped, though. Wow, my helmet is almost broke. Good thing I've got some iron. My boots aren't in great shape, either. Or my leggings. Actually, I'm getting pretty destroyed here. <laughs> Sounding a lot quieter out there, though. Oh, no. Ooh, I don't have the XP to fix my pants.
Well, I got diamonds on standby to make new pants, at least. Hopefully, I will pick up some EXP. Oh, it is turning nighttime, and, uh... You know what? This place is bad enough. And I can still hear some of these things flying around. I've reduced their numbers, but, uh... Definitely a lot of them. There are monsters nearby. <laughs> Better not be that butterfly it's talking about, because that's not fair. <laughs> Enjoy dropping. I don't know if there's really uh, a further that I can go at this point. Mr. Friggin' Ballista. I wonder if it'll let me sleep yet. Yes! At the very least, we can uh, try to cut down on the spawns going on here while I fight my way through. So many of these guys. Yeah! fall damage. <laughs> He's... He... What? How do you even do that? Right, the window. Oh, you got so much knockback on that thing. Sorry. Sorry, butterfly. I'm going out here. A, I am having my water bucket in my hot bar this time because that was close. What the? Where the hell is coming from? I got the spawner. I mean, there's probably more spawners. But acacia wood. Goodbye, other wood. Well, I'm gonna risk it. Power two punch. Uh, power two. I'm breaking. No. Huh, I'm not getting. Uh, I'm not getting tore up. I mean, there's definitely an up. To be had. Don't know how I get up there, though. You jerk. Is there a ladder in here somewhere? Doesn't seem to be, but there's definitely more, uh, more sights to be seen up there. Oh, I'm just going to tower. I'm going to build up. Dark Prismarine. Looks like I'm towering with Dark Prismarine. Oh, good source of blocks. I'm going to pop up here. I'm going to get shot off by a skeleton that I missed. I'm going to panic and miss my water bucket. 
now all I need to, is for everything to go better than expected. Something got the XP. <gasps> okay, that could have that could have gone worse. There's a benefit to me being up here. The worst part is most of this place isn't even made of wood. So I can't really burn this cursed place to the ground. Actually, enough of it is made of wood that I could get some shit going. <laughs> lighter Just gonna grab some blocks so yeah a lot of this is I have a feeling if I explore around there's gonna be more of the same missed my water bucket actually uh, get myself down to earth and resume my journey which is going to be a fun trip down probably shouldn't get too carried away here at least make sure I have an exit plan before I torch the place it. Yeah, I probably will miss that, actually. I think I can land in there. Oh, I... <laughs> pleasantly surprised. This will teach you to be a massive pain. Enjoy being on fire. And you! They don't drop any good loot. They take forever to crit out. And they have that ridiculous knockback. And that thing's got punch like Chewie's bowcaster. Beyond fire. This is pure sp. I'm gonna look back on this later and be like, gee, I wish I could explore that place more. So I'm gonna hate myself for this, I'm sure, but right now, I, this is just spite. I'm gonna start focusing more on exit and less on spite. Oh! Hello? It's sort of more of the same but different tower. Which, uh, those guys would mess me up if I just hopped down there. I know there's probably going to be another way. Ah, oh, yeah, ladder. That means more treasure. The, the sheer amount of iron this game just keeps giving me. Wish I had the EXP to fix my pants. Next, let me see if I have the EXP to fix my pants now. Four. Alright.
guys really want to be a pain in the butt over there, huh? I need you to... I need you to go down there and do a murder for me, would ya? Hey. Hey. Don't make me spleef you. Hey! There we go. That got his attention. tower now. Hopefully it's not too on fire. Whoop. Shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Wait, I summoned you. You're not supposed to get mad at me. This doesn't even make sense. Well, like I like I like I didn't have enough en enemies already in here. Took three bombs. All right, blue bomb. Ooh, ooh, that had some punch. Yeah, that got that got him. Nice. I had my shield up. Uh, see, as I get lower, the mobs become more reasonable again. All right. Let's chug down these honey bottles. Oh, hello, creepers. So, kind of seems like all these towers are, uh, similar. Jeebus. Gen on. Don't really regen much off of honey, do you? Oh, well, I gotta use it up. Let's see, what am I running? Okay, not dark oak, dark oak, dark oak. Yeah, I'll throw that right where I'm going. That way I can make sure I don't pick it up. I'm a genius. Wow, yeah, I am not regening off of this at all. All right, let's get uh, out of here. That's where I went in. All right, let's uh, let's get back to figuring out where they that way. Okay. Where did that go? Where did my thing go? Or 
Where's the eye? Come on, I can't afford... I can't afford to lose these eyes like... Oh, there we go. <laughs> Get off the tree, buddy. Oh. So kind of in that direction, then. Hope it's not, like, here. Hope this isn't what passes for the, uh... And fortress in the uh, stronghold in this mod. That works. Oh, shake. Right, let's head this way for a bit. And hopefully, the eye won't turn backwards next time I throw it. That's a big old house over there. My head was above the water. Yeah, honey is not a good one to try to rely on. Where's the doggo? Oh, I have bones! I have bones and I heard a howl. Where are you? Where are you? I want to tame you and be friends. in finding the dog that howled. Maybe it's an ambience thing and not an actual dog? Yeah. We're getting a biome change. This is big enough that this might be a fight place. Yeah, I'm thinking this is a fight place. Hey, Ender Pearls. Okay, this is actually a really <laughs> helpful chest to find right here. Hmm, starting to get low on arrows too. Gonna take Ender Pearls. Uh, an amethyst arrow. Another amethyst arrow. Iron chest plate. Good, I can use that to fix the one that's on me. That is a five cost, that is a twenty-one cost. Yeah, there we go. Am I getting jumped by ghosts? Ooh, apples. Whip up some golden apples. 
This is going to be my real food supply fulfilling meal, I would say. Golden fishing rod. Okay, so I don't know how to make a backpack this way. But let's see. Backpack disabled. Quirk oddities. Cyan. So they're just different colors. Hmm. So really, a sewing table. All right, that sounds like a rabbit hole. What is this? Oop. I don't know which direction I came from. I'm gonna get over there before I love the net. Hmm. Yeah, I just want to get away from this building so it doesn't just fly into the building on me before I love the next one. All right. So now golden carrots are on the menu until I scavenge food. Like these blueberries. Let's just get over here onto a tree. If I come across some pumpkins, I might make use of that for um, the end fight. Which way did it go? Oh, that way. Nice. And it broke, I think. Off ghosts. Another invisible skeletons, but they're kind of ghosts. It doesn't show me the name of them, so is it just skeletons with invisibility? Is it something special? Like how that ghost polar bear was a pol polar geist? That was actually the name. It's not just me doing a pun this time. I assume these. They're just uh, reskinned sweet berries. Blue. Eat a blueberry. Oh, hello. Yeah. All right, buddy. About time. About time. I got some reinforcement here. Instead of it being all me against the world. Hello, bear. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm getting out of there. Sorry. Polar bear AI, but uh, grizzly. That makes sense. Immediately killed by doggo. That was a grizzly spectacle. This is not on me, though. Ooh. Well, maybe I'll find another wolf. I feel bad, though. I tamed him, and he immediately gets murdered. And yeah, there's the classic sweet berries. wonder if I eat them if I'll get red. I continue collecting the blue ones. I know the sweet berries are not a very <laughs> efficient food. Actually, how do they compare? Light snack? Oh, light meal! Okay, blueberries are better than sweet berries. Interesting. I'm just hanging on to this so I can see if it gives me a chivo. Nope, didn't get red. Wild potatoes. This is really beautiful, though. 
pink dandelion. Ooh, that's pretty. Once I'm past the other side of that, I'm gonna chuck another eye. Tomato. Tomato seeds. Okay, it doesn't just give me tomatoes. I guess maybe I would have to grow them and then get tomatoes. Some weird looking soil. I'm gonna have a little look at that. Maybe it's stone. Grassy stone somehow. Overgrown day site. Okay. So it is some kind of grassy stone. It's almost like wood on the ground. Well, I'm not going over there because I know that's gonna throw those uh, vexes at me. And those are to deal with. Plus, it's only a few gold blocks and I'm not doing too bad on gold. Of course, I learned new things. Dead bush. while I'm in this because I'll lose it up a tree. So I'll push through the wilderness. Or at some point I'll be like, screw it and burn the wilderness down. Oh, I am getting a nice opening. Perfect. Beauty. And that is is, uh, is that a mob or a plant? It's just... What is this? I'm not sure that block's supposed to be invisible. Hey, a... A what? A desert temple, but snow. So, a wesert temple, maybe? Moose. Okay, so I am... <laughs> pretty sure you should not mess with the moose. I'm gonna check him out, so see, see. Hey, buddy. Oh, yeah, they fight, they fight. They fight. I mean. Oh, yeah. No, they're not too, too dangerous. You better drop some. Ooh, moose ribs. Okay. Guess I'm hunting moose. I found the Canada biome. <laughs> oh. Quite the uh, reach you got there. I get killed by a moose. That'll give me the cooked moose ribs. Hearty meal. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Snowy white biome. There seems to be a lot to replenish my uh, stores with. Okay, still going that way. Nice. That one broke too? Well, that's just mean. Alright, so I know I'm going this direction though, right? Before I get myself all turned around, I'm going to leave myself an arrow of sorts pointing in the direction I want to resume. There we go. Because I'm going to explore this, and I'm going to harvest some meese. Good 
Didn't I just kill you with a lava bucket and make my life easier? Oh. Yeah. Oh. 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 Jeez. Damage much? to cook them. Uh, yeah, I was like, I don't know what's going on there. Making quite the sound, though. Where did my lava go? I mean, there's... Oh! Yeah, cooked moose ribs. Sounds they make are awful. Ah, crap. I left him in too long. Burnt the moose meat. Now ah, that is unfortunate. So let's uh let's see what this desert temple wizard temple is all about. Oh my goodness. Okay. Of course. Of course there's strays. Multiple even. They just spawn in it. It's the trap. Oh! Oh! That was a bit more than the usual trip. I should have realized that there were... Dang, that, that was instantaneous. Well, whatever was in it... With my luck, probably would have been another god apple. Oh, hey, buddy. What do you got for me here? Anything interesting? Mm. Uh, the bottle of enchanting is somewhat... Dragon... Dragon... <laughs> mm. uh, I think I'm good. Thank you, though. Yeah, what am I dumping here? I can dump that. Because mm. I want to get some cobble. So that... Mm. Yeah, I hear you. So that way I can make an oven. So that way I can cook these. Can I? Oh, those are already cooked. Cook these moose ribs. Which are going into my new food slot. I like the goblin trader. Mm. Kind of adorable. Shows up randomly. Mm. Varying degrees of usefulness depending on what I got. Mm. Yeah. I hear you, buddy. Mm. Wait, that unlocked the new recipe? Hmm. 
I just cooked moose ribs. I guess probably because I cooked mm. one. Weird, though. Mm. All right. Time to head back on up. And uh, next time I come across these, I think I'll scout it out a little more. Hey, 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 no. Hey, come on, buddy. I'm trying to tower out of here. I assume you can teleport and you're good. Ah! Get TF out of here. Next up is going that way, so I'm going to recover this. Go boulder somewhere else. Mmm. Moose ribs. What is going on over there? Well, I'm checking this out. But I'm also checking this out because... Ah! Snowball zombie! Snowball zombie. Okay. 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 That's... Oh! Oh! Does he, does he do damage? Oh! Away from me. Get away from me. You guys better be friendly. You are nice. What are you doing here? Not quite who I thought you were, I guess. Yeah, here, baby zombie. Arrow slowness, uh, that would probably come in handy. I'm just gonna hop into bed and then I'm gonna pop back over and harvest them meese. The village? No, you're not. Dried kelp. Bed in this village. Also, assuming that this is a village. Hey, buddy. Nice and cozy in here. Forever bright. What was that? oh, ever bright portal, right? All right, now let's go back. I know there were. Yeah, there's the mooses, the meese. Cooked ribs. See if I can hit the uh, the moose mama. Uh, not a f oh no! Sorry, little one. Didn't mean to hit you. Though. How do I have slowness? Also, why are they not spitting out seeds? I'm pretty sure that's been in the game since before 1.16.5. So the creators of this mod would have had to have actively disabled that feature. Which is a weird choice. So 
that is three and a half shanks. More shanks, interesting. Probably less regen than the golden carrot, though. Maybe less um, saturation. Okay. Oh, we're still heading this way. Taking attack of opportunity on interesting sites and uh, any any uh, moose that I come across. going on in the village. Henry and Milo. Guard. Lumberjack. Eh, he's okay. Okay, we are getting to the point where I am going to chuck another eye. Make sure I'm on target. Well, I'm definitely still on target. Don't break. Thank you. Let's continue onward then. I'm just seeing if I can spot any more moose before I leave this biome. Moose unrealistic, they're not automatically aggressive. Alright, now I'm gonna head onward this way. Ooh, those are pretty. Zelkova. Frozen on me for a moment. I was loading. I have upgraded some an upgraded CPU, upgraded motherboard that are on their way. I splurged a little on Black Friday. So I'm going to be improving this experience for everyone involved. That is going to be a fight. Also, my sword and my axe are not looking like they... Whoa! Ah, more of these ghost assholes. Where's the other one? Sneaky ass floating bow. Oh boy. Started something. See if I can, yeah, see if I can get away with this. I don't need blue ice. Why? Why did I have blue ice? When did I pick that up? What else don't I need? Still hanging onto those bones in case I come across another doggo. There's an iron sword so I can fix mine up. 26. 17. Uh, that's a problem. I'm going to have to not use it for a bit. That's all right. What I'll do is I'll switch them out just for now. Sp 
smite one knockback. I like the sharpness better than the smite. Where did I approach this from? Pretty sure that way. The moose meat is my scavenged food for this bit of the adventure. Until I run out of it and have to get something else for that food slot. Trying to save my golden carrots and golden apples as long as I possibly can, at least. Well, it's probably going to be wasteful, but I'm going to huck another one. Where where did it go? Oh, that way. That way. Did I misunderstand where I came from? I'm going to be in real trouble if this is a nun eye. Okay. Don't break. Thank you. Could have sworn. A Zelkova sapling. Could have sworn I came from that way, though. I'll bubble along this way for a bit. Unless it's in S. I mean, probably not, right? I've been saving up this, uh... Saving up this obsidian so that I can go back to the nether. What do you mean? You Okay. Got to go back to the nether to try to hunt for more eyes. I can. That bear wants to take it me. Do I've been avoiding hurting the birds because? Oh, that's cool. Raw bird meat. Didn't want to kill the cute little burbs, but had to know what my options were if I run out of food and don't want to eat my carrots yet. Ah, don't like this. Well, which way did it? Which way did it go? Did it go down? Uh. <sighs> did it go down? It either went down or it got stuck in this tree. I think it went down. Oh, no, it didn't. It went... Oh, so then it probably is in that mess of a biome then. Awesome. Oh, oh. <laughs> the bear is the portal. Instead of the end dragon, it's the end bear you gotta fight. Oh, over there. Okay. Is the bear the portal? I think it went down. Uh, yeah. Well, that's what I'm gonna do. Oh, yeah. Now let's... See what kind of... Oh, it's definitely different. 
it is very different from what is that? Nether brick. Is that just decorative? Oh, spider hisses. Oh, there's more than more than one kind of spawner, huh? Uh... <laughs> he, he really just ran up in there like that. That's a problem. They've definitely uh, massively fleshed out the stronghold, so I don't know what I'm going to find or where I'm even going to go. <laughs> That's cool. Ooh, golden apple, though. Light meal, light meal, light snack, meal... Right now, bread is the front one runner. Well, I think I can safely deposit that at least. But again, I have a lot of bread. I just have it in hay bale form. All right, well, let's explore this whole new, uh, yeah, whole new uh, stronghold. Until it's getting uh, later into the stream, my words are not working right anymore. This is cool. I don't know what to expect from the end. Like, I assume it is not going to be the standard end fight. No, wait, why would I swing at a bat? Downstairs we go then. This is massively fleshed out. Now, let's see what this floor has. Ooh, beauty. Beauty. Also, I probably... Now, I'm going to save my levels in case I come across something good. But I am taking those apples. And still that iron. So at least if the end fight is uh, a little more than I would normally be prepared for, I can uh, call in some backup. Just rock up to the uh, rock up to the dragon like welcome to Gapplebees, and just start chowing down on get on uh, golden apples. Hoping I can find. Some ender pearls, though. This is no, 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 no. This is gonna be a challenging run if I can't. Definitely gonna have to go back to the Nether in the in that case. All right, let's go down the next floor. Seems more uh, like it's planned out. Less random. I definitely want to see what's over there.
Huh. Well, I'll check this first. Oh, yeah, gaps for days. Be able to just aggressively chow down on golden apples. Oh, that's cool. Didn't notice the item frames before. Let's try to be a little easier on my storage space here. Ooh, Ender Pearl, that's big. I think I've checked all these. Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah. So I came in this way. I know this isn't the intended layout because I went through some stuff. Oh, I can just set my spawn point in the stronghold without having to worry about making a, bre a bed. That is really... Ooh, yes. Thank you. It's kind of chill in here right now. Bed that I can slap next to the portal. Well, yeah, let's uh, let's go in through this. Ah, uh, she's definitely got more of a planned layout to it, so to speak. Like uh, rather than sort of a randomized layout like you see in the standard ones, this one seems to have a flow. And I thought that was a tall boy there for a moment. But instead of being a tall boy, it's just a statue. Stop tricking me out. I, I want Enderman, and you're showing me things that kind of look like Enderman at a glance. It's uh, kind of unkind. hearing any Enderman either. I hear what might be water. Scoria stone. Arid rock. Okay, I thought for a moment that it might be spawners up in that. Well, that is an upstairs. <laughs> Seen those dragon heads before. Yeah, there's a few upstairs paths. Nice, nice. I'm going to have plenty of gaps. Like, probably at this point I've exceeded the uh, amount of gold I can bring to the table. Out of 
curiosity, there are all this time. After all that time. My armor is not fit for this fight though. Skeleton, yeah, he sure was. Whoa, that's pretty cool. Well, this seems the opposite of the way I want to go, but uh, I'm gonna check it out real quick. Yeah, that didn't amount to anything. Stop being enchanted. Alright, let's resume. I'm encountering lots of skeletons now. It was quiet in here for a while. I want to just hop down to the next level. makes the uh ooh ooh fresh shield okay damn that's pretty cool is in pretty rough shape. So straight up finding that is kind of handy. What am I What am I ditching for it though? Pretty much everything here is uh, some degree of crucial. That's cool. So I can dip, I can uh, ditch my anvil here. Aqua Affinity, Smite 2. Let's see if there's anything else other than this guy and the Aqua Affinity version. Vision 2. That's interesting. Yeah, the Aqua Affinity version is uh, the better one to grab here. Well, at some point I had to make... I realize I don't have any wood for sticks or anything like that. It's going to make crafting kind of tricky. I might have to go back up. Should have thought that one through. What was I gonna do though? Uh, yeah, I was gonna make a golden apple. Free up a slot that way. Then I can grab this. What else we got in here?
I was kind of hoping there might be a secret sword behind that. That's what you get. Oh, I found it. We'll be able to see how screwed I am. Oh, wow. It's a nun eye. That is, uh, exceptionally cruel. Either, either that's how these are now, and it's always a nun eye, or I just got unlucky. That's wood, though. Petrified log. I wonder if I can do anything with that. Rot four, ugh. But it's also gonna break soon. What am I getting rid of here? Oh yeah, a single coal. Okay. Oh, it's functionally oak. That's, uh, that's pretty cool. Well, I have what I have here. I already have a crafting table. I'll set that up. I'll set the anvil up. Some more of that petrified wood. This is kind of cool, though. I wish it wasn't a nun eye. All right, petrified wood. The the log you mine with your pickaxe. I guess this is how you mine wood. I'm gonna gather something better. What are you? Are you friendly? You just chilling out, huh? Just a rando tortoise? Given how different this is, I feel like I can almost just expect the end to also be different. I'm not uh, I'm not sure if I'm looking forward to it or not looking forward to it, to be honest. There's a comfort in the familiarity. Yes! Just a picture of bread. The skeleton juked me. I need blocks for days. I assume I'm going to need blocks at least. And that is traditionally how the uh, 
and fight goes. Explore this a little more, though. I have pretty much as much, as many apples as I could possibly need here. So I'm gonna stop collecting them. Eh, if I'm grabbing sticks, I might as well grab sticks. Too bad none of these were pictures of ender pearls. the difference. I'm gonna check out more of this surrounding area. Boom block. Oh! Was I was I already here? I think I might have already Yeah, I was already here. There's all kinds of other cool side rooms in here though. I'm just gonna hope that I come across a few more end ender pearls. flint a flint a flint frame well, I, I am thinking I'm gonna save the actual end fight for a, another stream because we're coming up on six o'clock I'm tired I'm not doing words good and I could stand to sit differently but I'm still going to round this one out and just do a little more exploring here. Have I already been in this one? I don't think I have. Nope. But not what I meant to click. Feel free to give me more pearls though. anything good in those frames more petrified log that's handy porous petrified log what is it resin okay Looks like it keeps going down. I might, I might check this out a little bit. I know, I know where the room is now. Oh, hey, it's you, Goblin Trader. Sell me eyes. Do me a solid and sell me eyes, huh? Nope. Yeah, that that was kind of asking a lot. Night vision, night vision. Arid rock. <laughs> Emerald ore. Oh, 
I filled that right up. <laughs> mm. I wish I had my crafting thing open right now. Give me a moment. Mm. Yeah, I hear you. Yeah, that doesn't actually uh, save me anything space-wise. I'll just leave that there, because I... I did that wrong. Ooh, more diamonds. <laughs> hey, buddy. This clearly has uh, people like me in mind who are like, I think I have to go to the nether. Good to know that that is there, actually. I mean, that would that would take a bit of work to get that one into a uh, working state. And uh, I think I'm only one eye short at this point, so I'm kind of hoping I can find another... Uh, Either find an Enderman or find one more pearl. I'd hate to have to go to another dimension just to finish that out. Ooh. This is giving me some real Legend of Zelda vibes, though, with the sword to pedestal combo there. Is there even anything in these rooms? person could live here. You could start a whole village in this place. I'd attempt it to. You know, light it all up. I got tons of coal. Get some villagers. That'd be the tricky part is getting some villagers in here, actually. I don't know how I'd do that. Uh, except for... Uh, oh, this, this goes deeper. Okay. Eat the rest of my moose ribs. And actually, it is now a little after six. I'm gonna park myself somewhere reasonably safe and I'm gonna call her. I'm just looking to see who is on and playing Minecraft right now that I follow. Because we might as well roll Minecraft into Minecraft. On Wednesday, I am thinking of starting a nice, fresh, hardcore world. If 1.18 has officially dropped by then, which I think it might, I'm not entirely certain of the date, but I think it's real soon, then I will start that as a 1.18 hardcore world. And that'll be an ongoing sort of recurring hardcore world that I'll put a lot of time and effort into over the course of multiple streams. And on Friday, I am not sure yet. It'll probably be some kind of Minecraft, though. Ooh, that is better. That is better. Here's a good... Sp oh! Oh, no. No, wrong, wrong prot. Wrong prot. Unbreaking three, prot three. Yeah, here, here's, a, here's a good spot for me to call it, so let me just... Uh, huh. Looks like, looks actually like Filza is playing. Well, probably one of the more famous Minecraft streamers. Makes good content. Uh, I'm going, yeah, I'm going to raid Filza here. I think that'll be fun. Yep. So, uh, literally, I think just me and one other person at this point. Thank you for tuning in, though, folks. I'm going to do this raid. I'm going to end my...